I have some amazing Amazon finds to share with you today. So much so that we're not even going to do our regular intro. Let's just get right into it right after I tell you that I have a numbering system for you to be able to shop today if you want to. I will put up a number here on the screen that will correspond to whatever product that I'm holding up. You don't have to remember the name of the product or anything like that. You just have to make a note of the number, jot it down, do whatever to remember it. Then you'll see that number three, when you go down into the description box as you open it, next to that will be that product product, the color that I talk about, and the link, and you can shop that way if you'd like to. All right, let's get into it because we're going to be taking a little bit of time here. First, we're going to talk about my shirt, lightweight jersey knit tee with a v-neck crossover detailing in the front. It's kind of a little bit lower, but the crossover kind of gives you a little bit more modesty too. It's a long sleeve that I just like to pull up. It's a little bit longer and it goes over the tush and the tummy. And I just really like it. And then I pull it up and kind of rouge it to hide that a little bit more anyway. It's light enough that I feel like I can wear it in the daytime as we still have a little bit warmer days, but warm enough that it can transition me into the evenings when it's a little bit cooler. The next thing are the earrings that I have. These are a spiral earring in silver. These do come in a two-tone and then they also come in the gold, I believe. They might already also come in a black, which I think are really pretty. They have the rhinestone spiral in the center of it. And I just really love these. I've shown them on my channel before, but I wanted to wear them. And so I was showing them again. And then this is a layer necklace that came in layers of three. I only put two on today, but what I want to show you is that I also discovered these really cool clasps that you can use. And what's so neat about them you just take any necklaces that you have and then you put them on this magnetic clasp and the clasp will hold two or three and there's probably ones that have four too so this one came in a package of four some gold and some silver ones because it's magnetic so it just goes together really easy it won't fall off of you no matter what because that clasp is pretty tight but it's not so tight that it's hard to get on and off and it's so easy to be able to just put that on without worrying about those silly little lobster cl lobster clasps that i have a hard time with my fingernails with so that was really fun the next picture I'm going to show you is of another shirt that I'm wearing and it is a teal color shirt it's kind of a deepened teal that has a beautiful crochet overlay on it and it's such a pretty detail on this shirt long sleeve again but this one is a little bit more heavy than the one I have on and then I'll show you the detailing really close on that shirt it's just so pretty I really have been loving that and just one of those shirts that is really nice as we're going into the fall winter I'll also with that shirt have on a really pretty silver bracelet. It's just a pretty cuff bracelet. Kind of goes with what I'm wearing, so I'm going to keep that on for a minute. It's laced and it just is your average size cuff bracelet and I really like it. And then with that shirt, I also do have on these earrings. I'll switch this out really quick so that you can see this earring. This is a boho earring that is just so cute. It has the shells on it, the beads on it. The beads are blue. I believe this comes in another color. I'm not don't quote me 100% on that, but I believe it does come in another color. This is kind of a burnished brass color on the metal. These are so pretty and they are just really nice if you're somebody that likes wearing earrings that are really dangle, which is my jam anyway. I also want to show you this robe right here. This robe has been so nice for me. I bought this last year, but I thought as we're going into the winter months and the fall months, we need cozy. We need everything to be cozy. This robe is so soft and yummy and it fits great. It has a hood on it, which I've never had a, a robe with a hood on it. I've always just had them with the collar on them. It comes down to a really good length and you can cuff the sleeves. This is just a super cozy robe and I really wanted to share it because it's not very expensive. It's just a really nice robe. I also wanted to share my latest Skechers find I love Skechers. I show a pair of Skechers almost every time I do one of these Amazon videos. Skechers is such a good shoe for me. For one, I always buy the one that is just the bungee for the shoelaces. I love being able to just slip in my shoes. I don't know whether I'm just getting that old or whether I'm just that lazy. Pick your poison there. But I really do love these. And I think that these are so cute because they are black and white, but they have a little silver thread that goes through here that's kind of a shimmer. I love to wear these to every place I go to because they're just so stinking comfortable. I hear you. You're saying, where's the purses? Well, they're here. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the purse that I chose to put in today's video. This is a beautiful purple maroon colored purse. 
this is basically basically your hobo bag that I love so much, but I love the gunmetal detailing on this one. And I love this stitching on these. They're just so nice. And then if you have a purse like this that's really big, you really need to think about getting one of these inserts right here. I just love having them for organization. You can just pull them out and put them into your next purse. This one is a longer one and a little bit bigger, but I still love it so much. And then there is a buckle detailing on this purse as as well and I just think that this one is really cute comes in a ton of colors for you if you want different colors too and I love this plummy purple and then the other one that I have to show you is such a cute purse this purse has all of these gold rivets on it and the detailing with the gold but what is so fun about this particular one itself is that you can go in here and unbuckle this and out comes another purse that is so cute. Here's the strap that goes to it. And then it also has like the little wallet clutch or the little makeup clutch that goes with it. So it's actually three pieces. It's just so darn cute and they all go in there. And yeah, lots of colors on this one as well. I brought this up here because I had to show you. My house is kind of done in a farmhouse style, but this is such a dang cute box with the lid for your laundry soap, but it's not laundry soap that I keep in here. I keep my OxyClean in here and it has the scoop. I measured it. It's the exact same scoop that the OxyClean has inside of its tub. So I just keep them in here and I keep this on my dryer along with the one that you saw before that is the dryer sheet one that has the um, lid on it that's hinged. So cute. You could even keep this on your counter and not use it for laundry. You could put anything in here, wash rags, anything you wanted to. And I just think it'd be so cute even in a bathroom. It's just a cute piece and I just had to share it with you. All right, on to some beauty. I am really excited about these new Paw Paw beauty sponges that I found. I don't remember. I think it maybe was Juicy Jazz's channel. I think it was her channel and she was talking about how good these are. And Oh man, these are soft. They are amazing. Okay, six of them is for $10, which is a great price anyway. They're from the company AOA, which is, I think it's the Shop Miss A brand, but you can get them on Amazon and not have to pay for the shipping just if you want this one product. But anyway, here it is. This is the one that I used today and haven't cleaned yet, but this is what they look like when they come out of the package and they do double in size but this is so soft that if you didn't want to get up and wet this you you wouldn't have to but I can't do that. I have to have my makeup sponges damp. So I love these. I really, they are so very soft. I just cannot believe how soft they are compared even to the Beauty Blender. I think they're a little softer than that. That's what she was saying. And that's really why I went and picked it up. And sure enough, they feel very, very soft. And I think they're quite a bit softer than the Beauty Blender. Now in talking about that, I wanted to share with you from Eco Tools. I don't use this for my brush cleaner. This is this is a brush and makeup sponge shampoo. I don't use this for my makeup brushes. I use the Cinema Secrets, but I do use this for these sponges. And I like this because it's a pretty low sudsing shampoo. So you don't have a lot of suds that you're gonna sit there and try to, you know, wring out of these for an hour, but it does the job so well. So I just get a little bit damp like this and then I just spread a bunch across there and I just work it until it comes clean and it does get them 100% clean. This is a great shampoo for sponges, but I'm sure it would be just as good for brushes as well. Also, the two most common questions that I get in the comment section is how do you get your teeth so white? So that all this is is the basic crest white strips. These are the brilliance white ones. I do this as a maintenance in between getting cleanings at the dentist. I was really blessed by my mother with really good teeth. I do have fairly white teeth to begin with anyway, but this helps keep them so sparkling white and clean. And I just absolutely love them. So you just put them on, you just kind of press them down in between each tooth and they work so well and I continue to buy them over and over again. So those are great. And then the other question that I get is how do you get the, your eyes to look so white? And that is Lumify. I have had Lumify for probably four or five years. I do wear contacts. I get up in the mornings. I don't wear these every day. I don't put them in every day. I will put these in um, on days that I film or days that I have to go somewhere special. So I just put like two drops in each eye and then I wait 20 minutes and I go ahead and put my contacts in. But these keep your eyes so white for hours and I absolutely love them. And this little bottle will last me Gosh, it will last me almost a year. That's how long those are. And I just, I love those. They've been with me for a very long time. And then Jan Phelps one day was talking about the Tree Hut 
um, moisturizing shave oil. This one is coconut lime. And I got this and this is amazing. It makes your legs so slick to be able to shave with, which is awesome. But it also is an oil, so it leaves behind some moisture afterwards. Definitely a coconut lime smell, but I know that there's a lot of different fragrances in this. So I think you'll really love it because it's just so easy to work with and it makes your skin really soft since it is an oil afterwards. So this is a repeat customer and I've bought this so many times. This is the Lady Monkey Butt Anti-Friction Powder. The ingredients in here are cornstarch, calamine powder, tricalcine, calcium phosphate and fragrance that's all that's in here and this is the greatest powder i sweat when i went into menopause i thought i was gonna die because i was dripping with sweat all the time especially the boobs i'm sorry the boobs sweat and between the thighs yes they sweat and the you know you get all of it so this is my favorite powder for all of that i wear this almost every single day and if i don't wear it i miss it and i can tell that i'm not wearing it but this is a great powder and it's just one of those powders that once you try it you'll know why you want to use this instead of regular baby powder it's just a really good powder also i have talked about this before many times on my channel. This is the um, OGX Botifying Bamboo and Fiber Full Big Hairspray. And this is an amazing hairspray. My favorite hairspray of all time is the Kenra 25, but it can be a little bit pricey. This is awesome. This is the runner up to it. This acts just like it. It leaves my hair feeling fairly soft, not crunchy at all but it holds like the dickens i mean it's so so good it just holds my hair in place and it's what i reach for all the time especially when i run out of my kenra it's just such a good hairspray and melissa 55 puts her stamp of approval on this and she's the one that i heard about that one from also i've been talking to you all lately a lot about the timeless vitamin c that i have gotten into recently and i love this stuff so it's 20 percent vitamin c ferulic acid and vitamin e you want those other ingredients to buy buffer and help your skin as well. This is a great vitamin C. I don't have any sensitivity with it, but if you do, you might want to go easy on it, meaning you might want to use it like every other day or work into it as you can. Some people have a low tolerance to vitamin C, especially when it's just the regular strength of it or the scorbic acid vitamin C. So definitely for me, I see a huge difference with this. I've been using it for several months now, and this is a repurchase for me too. I'm now buying it in the two pack, which seems to be a lot cheaper than just buying it by itself ends up being about $16 per bottle. Okay, really quick mention of these velvet scrunchies and they have my hair all in them. I have been wearing these for a long, long time. Um, I can't remember who talked about it. It might've been Melissa 55. Again, I get so many good ideas from her. But what I love about wearing a velvet scrunchie is every single night when I go to bed because I'm wearing skincare and I usually have stuff slathered, I pull my hair up out of the way. And if I just use a regular satin scrunchie, it falls out immediately. But these grip like no other. And so you're gonna have these on and they're gonna keep your hair out of the way. They're a little bit more than the satin ones, but boy, for me, they are worth it because they hold your hair so much better than the other ones do. I really love those instead of the satin ones that I purchased previously. And then I wanna talk about, I don't talk about this very often, but I do try to mention it about once a year, once every six months, is my beloved X Lash. And this is how I get my eyelashes to grow so long and are thicker than they've ever been in my life. And you can use this on your eyebrows if you want to, and your eyelashes. You only have to use this once a day, which makes this unique from all the other serums that I have tried before. You've had to use it twice a day. And since I only have to use this once a day, the tube lasts me for about six months. Sometimes it lasts me longer than that. And you just paint it along your lash line and that's all you do. You can paint it in your eyebrows if you want to, but this is a double the size of a regular one like Grande Lash or Revital Lash. So it's a double the size for a lot less. So this has been, for me, it's one of those ones that I repurchased. This is probably like my 20th or 30th tube of this that I've ever had. I love it so much. Also, after I did the video for you guys about bifida and galactomyces, 
I rediscovered the Benton Fermentation Eye Cream, and I am loving this. I feel like this is really helping to firm up my eyelids and help me so much with this crepey skin that's around my eyes. Now, I will go in with this one as a treatment. So this has got galactomyces and bifida in it. So you're using it as a treatment around your eyes, which brightens, helps with smoothness or wrinkles, and it also can help depuff. Now, the dark circles, it really doesn't help me that much with. Mine are inherited, so there's not a lot I can do about it, but it really is a great cream and I've just been really enjoying it so much. I wanted to show you these cute, this isn't anything to do with beauty, but aren't these cute, these little antique looking scissors? These come in a pack of two. They're very, very sharp and they're usually used for needlework, but I saw them and I was just like, oh my gosh, I love those. And then I went and I bought my mom some. She loves them. She loves the antique looking things. So this is a really great gift to be able to give her. And if you have a seamstress in your life, I'll leave the link for the actual seamstress kit down below these so that you can see that too but these have been great scissors for me i'm always needing a pair of scissors by my bed also want to show you this fan this is a fun fan for me because i always want a fan to help dry like when i spritz my face with my setting spray or whatever i'm using at that minute sometimes you want your skincare sometimes you want your nails to dry a little faster but this has three speeds on it which is great it moves the air quite well but what i also like about this is its footprint will sit onto a desk. It will sit straight up unless you bump it over and it doesn't wobble around. I can grab it if I'm having a hot flash or whatever I need it for. And I've really been enjoying having that. This comes in a bunch of different colors. And then when I'm talking about things I repurchase from Amazon over and over again, once a year, I talk to you about the Kenra 19. This is a thermal protect thermal protectant, but it also helps me keep my curl in place in my hair, which is great for me because I do have a tendency to have very fine, straight, limp hair. But this one, if I, cur if I spray this on, and then let it dry and then just brush it through and then curl my hair. This helps keep my curl. Like no other product that I've ever found, Kenra is such a great line. This one helps keep your curl, but using it as a thermal protectant and something that you can use right before you curl your hair, really a great product. I've purchased this for probably 10 to 15 years. This has been in my hair care stash forever. Also, I've been dying to share this with you guys. This is the Not Doctor from Infinity Pro by con air and i've got a ton of hair in here i use this thing all the time what i love about it is it comes apart really easy so you can take the top off of this and you can just use this like a regular hair dryer if you need to it also has an attachment where you can just go up like a comb and use it like a comb to dry your hair the revlon one was way too hot for my hair i liked it for a little while but it got so hot one time that it actually burnt my hair and after that it was like no get rid of that so i got rid of it and i kept looking for one i tried the dry bar one i've tried another one that was on amazon i can't remember the name but they were all too hot and i was just like like my hair is too fine to have that kind of heat on it. And then I came across this one. And what I love about it is you do have the, you have three different speeds on here. So you have a low and then you have a high, but you also have one that is a high, but just a cool flow of air, which is great because it is so dry where I live that that cool flow of air anyway will dry my hair pretty good. So most of the time I never turn this on the high heat setting. I always just either keep it on the low or on the cool. And then when I'm using the low, I can also push this button right here and get a cool shot. And if you want to get that curl and you want to put it on the hot, you can do that and then hit the cool shot right here as well so that you can cool it down quickly if you need to. This is a really great value for the money, I think. I think it's so much better. I loved it so much better than the dry bar one which I know that that one was pretty expensive. It was like 150 when I bought it and it went straight back because it was just too, too hot. So this one's been really good for me and I really wanted to show it to you. Last item, these are both RFID wallets, meaning that they can definitely keep you safe with all of your information. I have shown this one on my channel before. It has the cutest little B on it. This comes in a million billion colors. It's just a cute little wallet. They're about the size of a large credit card. A large credit card. They're about the size of a credit card. 
<laughs> and then this one is the newest one that I got for the season right now. And I'm really enjoying this teal color. It's just a color that I'm kind of into. This one I do like though, because you can attach your keys onto this one. It has a cute little tassel. And then on this side of it, it can, does have the place for your ID. So you don't have to, you know, search for your ID. But basically it's just an accordion style that you can fit a million different credit cards down into the other one is the same one the same thing it looks exactly the same inside so it's just a really great concept to be able to have them all um, divided and to be able to see them so quickly it's just easy for me to take this with my keys and not worry about having to take a full purse if i don't want to so this is just really good so that's it for today's video i hope that you did enjoy it please give it a thumbs up on your way out of here we're not going to take a lot of time but i will throw another amazon video up right here so that you can see it i hope you guys are all doing really well please come back around really soon for my next video take care of yourselves and i will see you very soon love you much goodbye my friends